The Hayes County Commissioner's Court tonight gave final approval to a deal that would more than double the nature preserve around the historic Jacobs Well site. The $1.7 million deal is designed to protect one of the state's most treasured natural resources. Only on KXAN Austin News, Jim Swift helps us understand just what's at stake. The first time David Baker scrambled over these hill country rocks was in the spring of 1988. He was in the market for a rental house in the area. The person who was helping me look for, for, look for a home pulled up and said, David, I, I forgot your place, two little stone houses at Jacob's Well. And I came down the steps and the hair on my arm rose up and and uh, I looked, at, looked down and saw the spring and I said, I'll take it. Jacob's Well is actually a water-filled cave that drops a mile deep into the Edwards Aquifer. It is what is called a perpetual artesian spring that pumps thousands of gallons a minute to the surface. New residential development is creating demand for more water wells in the area. And in the spring of 2000, Jacob's Well stopped flowing for the first time in recorded history. The flow stopped again in 2008 and 2009. One of the most important things for our existence is water. And if we, uh, if we dry up this spring, uh, our water wells and our, our drinking water is not far behind. And this story does not stop with the well itself. You see, the water coming out of Jacob's well moves on downstream, down Cypress Creek, three, three and a half miles, and emerges right here in a place called Blue Hole in the small city of Wimberley. It is one of the most popular swimming holes in the entire state. 16,000 people came this last summer to swim in this hole, jump off that swing. And um, we're, we're expecting the park to, to grow with the new facilities that will be in by this time next year to up to 100,000 people will, will use it. Former Wimberley Mayor Steve Klepfer is leading a $4 million campaign to create a 126-acre regional park around the swimming hole. We're sure that the biggest threat to this park in the long term is not having water coming out of that well. We need to share this special place with the community if we're ultimately going to protect it. But we want them to tread lightly on the land. There will be limits, much like there is at Hamilton's Pool or West Cave. We will have a capacity limit on, on how many people can access at one time. Baker, now the executive director of the Jacobs Well Natural Area, expects the new rules to be in effect before the end of next year. Meanwhile, come and visit it to uh, appreciate it, take, take a cool dip in the spring, but leave it better than they found it. In Hayes County, Jim Swift, KXAN, Austin News. You've never been to Jacob's Well or Blue Hole? Here are the spots. You can take a closer look and keep up with developments on this story through some web links we have with this story. You can find it on the local news page at KXAN.com.